Welcome, and thank you for joining us as we discuss the route of administration for Kinmobi, apomorphine hydrochloride sublingual film. Kinmobi is the first and only sublingual formulation of apomorphine. Not a pill, not an injection, not an inhaler. Kinmobi is available in five dose strengths, 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30 mg sublingual films. The maximum single dose of Kinmobi is 30 mg. Before taking Kinmobi, patients are required to drink water to moisten their mouths, which helps the film dissolve more easily. Then, the entire Kinmobi film must be taken whole and placed under the tongue as far back as possible. Kinmobi sublingual film dissolves in approximately three minutes. Patients should remember not to chew or swallow Kinmobi and to avoid talking while the film dissolves, as this can affect how well the medicine in Kinmobi is absorbed. Please note, this is not the complete set of guidelines and should not take the place of reviewing the full prescribing information for Kinmobi or the instructions for use with your patients. Upon sublingual administration, apomorphine, the active ingredient in Kinmobi, is absorbed by the blood vessels underneath the oral mucosa, where it is transported into the systemic circulation. Once in the systemic circulation, apomorphine is delivered to the brain. Sublingual delivery allows transport of apomorphine to the brain by avoiding first-pass metabolism when absorbed through the oral mucosa, which may significantly reduce the bioavailability of apomorphine and delay its transport into the brain. Since apomorphine is highly lipophilic, it can cross the blood-brain barrier and enter the brain. Once in the brain, Kinmobi is believed to stimulate postsynaptic dopamine D2 type receptors within the caudate putamen to treat symptoms of off episodes associated with Parkinson's disease. We appreciate you joining us today. For additional product information and support services, please visit www.kinmobi.com or call 1-844-KINMOBI.